It's the end of 2023, which means I think it's time to show you my instruments. Starting off with the biggest thing in my room, my drum set of course. This thing is my baby. I have spent so much money on it. It's a seven piece D-Drum AMX Dominion kit with, of course, my large collection of red cymbals. Go check them out in the description, they're amazing. Around fall, I was able to add some microphones. You got snare, overhead, and kick. I'm hoping to get some more at some point, but they're pretty expensive. And my interface only has four spots for microphones. I'll need to upgrade that at some point. Next, we've got my keyboard. This is just a little Casio keyboard that I found at a thrift shop for $10. It didn't have a power supply when I bought it, so I just had to take it home and hope it worked. Turned out it did work, and it's amazing. I did have to buy the pedal and the stand separately. Up next, we've got my tuba, of course. This is the instrument I've been playing the longest. This is my king tuba with a recording bell. It's four valves, as you can see, and I bought it off eBay. This is the instrument that gets the most attention, of course. This is my Ophiclide. I'm a huge nerd for music and instrument history, and this right here is the coolest thing I've ever found. I could go so deep into the history of brass instruments, but other people have already done it, so I don't really need to. The very simple version is, this is what came before tubas. It has no brand, I bought it for $1,000 off eBay. Vesex tubas actually make some of these, they're a lot better quality. If you're interested in Ophiclide, go check them out. These things are just cool. They sound terrible though. <laughs> What do we have here? It's a bassoon, of course. This is not my bassoon, this is the school's, and I won't have it much longer because I graduate in May. This bassoon is a Schreiber, and it's not the worst thing. There's definitely some air leakage in it, but honestly it plays and it sounds decent. I don't get to play it much because I'm not using it in a class at school, but I like to just mess around on it because bassoon's a fun instrument. I'm hoping to get one at some point, but right now I don't have the money. Would you look at that, it's a trumpet. This trumpet is a Bach, and it's really funny because I don't know how to play trumpet. I've been trying to learn, but I suck at it. <laughs> Coming from a tuba background, this mouthpiece is way too small and I'm not used to it. I can play a B-flat scale, but any higher or lower, es ist nicht gut. I have my two djembes, of course. They're Toka brand. And I'm gonna be honest, I don't know the sizes. I love hand percussion, I'm just not the best at it. I've got these Oudstar mini bongos. I got these on my birthday in 2020. They were the first percussion I ever had. I know these aren't instruments, but this is my mouthpiece collection. Go all the way from tuba down to trumpet. All right, now it's time for all my little trinket instruments. Starting us off, we have my ocarina. This little thing is made of plastic and just sounds like a recorder. Here we have a tambourine. It's pretty standard. There's nothing too interesting about it. Here we have my claves, they're Minel brand and they sound pretty good. Here we have a small rain stick. It's supposed to simulate the sound of rain. I've never thought they sounded like rain, but it's a pretty cool instrument. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what to call this thing. It just makes this noise. Here we have an automaton, which is actually out of batteries and I don't have any more, but if you want to hear an automaton, just go watch The Real Soli G. His videos are incredible. And of course, the most important instrument ever created, the cowbell. 
And that's it for now. I'm always looking for new instruments. Right now, I have my eye on a quintaclov and a chimbasso. I also wouldn't mind a contrabass flute, though. They all cost a lot of money, and I'm not sure I can get them, but I'm always looking. But other than that, have a great new year, and I'll see you later.